till later in the day. Mm -hmm. How does that feel during the day? During the day, I feel really focused. I actually don't even know that I'm not eating. So that's really good. So what I would love to know is show me what your blood sugars are doing during the day and show me if you make ketones. That'll be the answer is you when you have excess insulin, which is this chronic disease maker, uh, it is what makes cancer. It is what makes high blood pressure. It is what makes debris in the brain where call it depression or brain fog or Parkinson's. It's the aging of the brain. It's linked to all of those things. All of those things. And that excess insulin, nobody tells you about. But the symptoms are, dang, I feel like I got to eat every two to three hours. Uh, their debris uh, or their fuel keeps running out. When you say, boy, I can eat uh, once at the end of the day and I'm pretty good. My focus stays really good. What I want you to prove is, what are your ketones during the day? So when, when you've got a patient who has done that, their ketones will be 0.7. 1.0. And they're taking out the trash all day long. So there's these two energy sources. One of them is the glucose. One of them is, which is from like, you know, eating pasta, which I ate last night. Um, so that probably put a lot of glucose in my, my blood. I probably had a high glucose spike and then insulin came out to deal with that. And then there's ketones, which start to appear when I'm fasting or when I haven't been eating carbs for a while and my body's looking for an energy source. Yeah. When it, in terms of these